welcome back to another Unity 3D Asset Store review. In this video, we're checking out the HQ Residential House. That's high quality, I'm assuming, with the HQ. That's from Not Lonely. Got 60% off till the end of July. Couldn't help it. $28. Well, let's pop into Unity and see what it's like. Inside Unity 3D, I've opened up the demo scenes folder and I'm just too excited because look, lots of demo scenes. Which one should we open first? Showcase, real time, set up night, set up day, module showcase, bait set up night, bait set up day. Oh, hi, let's just go. Showcase sounds very showy. So fly on my arm, go away. So let's pop in. And oh, okay, there you go. Can we walk around in here? Is it like a supermarket? No, it's just a, what a fireplace. Oh, that looks lovely. Look at all this stuff we get. Oh, oh, this makes this makes me happy. Come on, sixty percent off. I should have got this earlier. Oh wow, all right. Oh, that's, that is nice. Look at that sofa. That looks like a photo of a sofa. Even the, even this looks nice. Oh, okay. Let me have a look at the books. I'm always, I'm always checking out books whenever I get an asset. I like to have a library in my game. I've got loads of different books from different asset creators. Oh, these are nice. These are good books. Rocking chair. That's a nice rocking chair. All of, all of that is. Oh, I'm just. You can tell I'm a little bit happy. Alright. Real time set update. Let's pop in. Hopefully we're gonna get a first person control and we can walk about. Otherwise we'll have to drop one in, but alright, let's click play. Come on. Yep, alright, my computer's starting to have a gap set. So here we are, we're inside our new house. Can we open the front door? Press E to open. Oh, and can we close it? How do we close it? Oh, okay, he's got he's got his UIs one over the other. I can forgive that because I do you know why I can forgive that because when you close it, it has a little bouncy animation at the end. So look, you now you slammed it, so it bounced. What have we got in this one? Um, dodgy plant texture, not great. Um, Bland wall. Okay, it's like it's been cleanly painted. What was that on the? As you walk towards this unit, the texture suddenly just appears. All right. So curtains. All right. I like the rails at the top. It'd be nice if the walls were a little bit dirtier, like a lived-in feel. It just feels like a show, show house at the moment. There's that lovely sofa that I fell in love with. Oh, what's this? Open the. Ah, it's open the window. Well, we'll change those ourselves later when we've got it in a game. Again, coffee mug. This is the weird LODs they've got set up. A couple of weird. Yeah, look. I think it's a little bit. Demo scene, I don't know, we'll have to play about and have a look at the files later, but I think she seems to pop in. Pop in, let's pause it. Um, let's, let's have a look quickly. Oh, we've got some errors. 15 errors. Render update manager must call, must be called first. No idea what that is, it's late, my brain is not working. I just want to play about with a demo. I need to go back inside. Worry about these LEDs just magically appearing textures later. So uh lots of things, lots of books, furniture, ornaments that we're getting. So um can I can I push this fucking chair? No, we've had that ourselves. Light switch This house has got a light switch. It's actually doing anything, but fair play. It's got. Oh, hang on. Did it? Yeah, it turned off that light. Okay. 
we've got a fully furnished kitchen so it's a lot of assets in this kitchen alone this is not an abandoned house any stretch of imagination opening cupboards oh I'm gonna play with sorry guys but I'm gonna play with this I'm gonna play with this a lot as soon as we can work out why these textures are just magically popping in and out oh we get a TV what is this and these oh guys there is everything I like these little touches because a lot of artists they just make their models and everything's just one big block one big mesh let's see what about this he says no I am you know I, I can't that's a little bit weird. So, those open. And we have this everyone. Wait, this house is massive. It's all modular. I'm assuming that we can pretty much build what we want. And he's got a garage. What have we got in the garage? Is he. He's. I oh, thought, okay. It's got DIY, a lot of DIY stuff. It's a bit like Dexter. It's going to be a body. I'm going to come up. I'm going to come across a body. Oh, I'm so happy. Come on. Mate, the garage doors are opening. I really, I've found like a couple of floors that we found so far. By floors, not double O R, but A W. So, um, oh, I managed to do two things at once. And we've got a mirror. Come on, what? E to double the light. So um, lighting is a little bit. I mean, we can see the we'll have we'll check out the baked one as well afterwards. Um, it's got the stairs. Let's run up the stairs. More pictures on the walls. Look how many rooms. This house is massive. How many rooms are we getting? More books in the top. Everything's just thrown all over the place. Another TV. Well, it's the same TV as downstairs. Maybe a bit smaller. I'm not too sure. More drawers that we can open up. Oh come on more a little ladies vanity table is that what they're called nice bed they haven't made the bed when they got out maybe a zombie apocalypse happened and he didn't have time to make the bed I can't close that window um what have we got we got a proper bathroom in this house we got a bath we got a window we've got another sink Find some medicines in there if you're looting this house. You know, if someone looking, where would I stick things if we're looting? And where would you stick loot? Where would you stick it in this massive walk in wardrobe? Is where you'd stick your loot, wouldn't you? Oh, can you tell that I like this asset yet? Oh, I love opening up an asset and just clicking record. So you're getting always getting my reaction as I'm loading out for the first time. So all of this is really like you know I don't like editing as you can tell by now like 30 videos into my YouTube channel I'm not great on the old editing so um, what you hear is what you get my word can I open this no ah oh, I thought we'd be able to open up that clothes basket can we open the toilet no see if you just had these toilet if you could open up the toilet and then flush it you sir would be getting five stars and little things like that really make me very happy so you are coming so close so close but oh turn the light off so you've got lights you can do that with a toilet kids room this kid's a mus musician here in the rest. What have we got on the bed? Nice bed. Can we climb up on the bed? I'm going to make us climb up on the bed later. Code that in. Make this climbable. What's opening? Oh, that's the window to open. Look at it. I mean, this is modular. Everything is modular in this. So you can build your own house how you want it, furnish the room. And there's enough furniture we can get to be able to furnish house in so many different ways. The safe opens. You know what I'm gonna do with that, don't you? So, 
This is Daddy's desk. Kids, Daddy's working. Leave him alone. All right. Have we got another floor to this house? Have we got a roof? Oh, we got the baby's room. Creepy looking teddy bear. And changing. All right. Oh, a painting on the wall. B and A. Barry and Andy. So, what do I like? What do I think of this house so far? Oh, I think this house is pretty damn amazing. I really do like this house. I like this house a lot. I like that lots of wardrobe space. I would move in. I like the fact we've got this dining table. I love the fact we've got this. We don't have any knives on the table. So how are we going to cut our food with no knives? Well, the plants are not bad. Um, the furniture I really like. They're simple. It's not too. It doesn't look like there'll be too many polys, but um, let's open the front door. Let's get out. Hang on before we go outside. And let's up to our attention again just to the textures. So. One of the things that I'm going to mark this down for are the textures. Now, now, hang on. Don't dump all at once and start screaming at me. What are you talking about? What's wrong with the textures? Well, I feel like I'm in an IKEA catalogue. Do you know what I mean? Everything is too clean. I mean, I'm sorry, but in a house where people are living, your textures are not going to be so clean and so pure and they're a bit bland to be honest the textures are bland they're, they're i mean look at this this is beautiful but boring beautiful but boring uh that's what people say about me most times but that's um look at this wall here it's just walking around the house here there's nothing really on this wall to make it stand out i mean you've got a little bit here Let's have in the corners a bit of filth. I mean, how clean is this house? They need to be, um, well, I think they've got OCD or something, whoever lives here. So add a few, add a few more dirty textures somewhere. Uh, mixed up the, I mean, there's painted walls, but we want to have some nice wallpaper or like that little trimming that goes around the wall. You know, you know, when people don't, you know, they don't put the entire wallpaper up, they just put that little strip that goes along the wall because they can't be bothered to get a whole load of wallpaper. That, one of those. That might help to pick it up a little bit. Um, look at this. This, this is lovely. And the picture is lovely. But this unit here, it's, it's perfect. There's no chips. There's no, nothing real about it to make it, make you think, oh, this, hang on, somebody lives here. Um, same with this unit. It's, it's made, is that an effort? Has he made a little bit of an effort there? There's a little bit of a scuff. A little bit of scuff. Um, so maybe you're thinking that you need to do it, but not enough in my books. Not enough. Too clean, too pure, too much IKEA. This is an IKEA home. And the door opens the right way. Can we open the garage? The garage is open from the outside. So. This this uh, demo scene has got my seal of approval. Look at this lovely house from the outside. What's that? What? These weird American weird houses with air conditioning units. Um, and we've got the weird LOD issues on the objects with the lighting. Not sure why the lighting's so funny on the LODs. Other than that, what do I think deep down, having just bought it and not gone to bed? Um, I really like it. I really like it. Uh, little things like the walls. See, I'm thinking, how can I integrate this with something like you construct EBS, Ultimate Survival, so we can have someone build this house in game in real time, like sit there and build this house. Um, at the moment, it's a bit difficult, isn't it? Because it's not really set up in that way. Depends what you want it for. If you want a modular kit so that your players can build this in game then this is not really this is not for you for that purpose I don't think if you're doing um, 
a house like a cityscape that you want to put a load of houses in and just change how the layout of them so they look different and mix it up a bit and this is perfect would I use this have I got use for this um, I didn't before I bought it to be honest I just really liked it um, but now I see just how many props we get but other than the lack of knives other than the fact the toilet seat doesn't open and close and flush other than the fact that the microwave doesn't open but the safe does um, did the fridge open I didn't check out the fridge the fridge opens then I'm gonna be oh that's see that this opens this doesn't you don't open sir that's a little bit annoying oven oven doesn't open little things little touches like that have your appliances open and you get a lot more kudos from me at the moment your your appliances don't open that's a downside so hopefully future updates that might get um, addressed hopefully who knows so as it stands we need to review this and score this as the kit today and as today before the end of July it's 60 percent off so at that price I would say definitely get your credit card out and buy it tonight don't waste any moment for it to sell to end just get hold of it and then work out what you're going to use it for later because it is crazy the amount of stuff that we just got for that price it's nuts it is I mean I can't emphasize enough how crazy this 60% sale is I mean, look at all I mean, we saw the showcase but come on you know I mean the carriage I love it I love it well out of five I need to give this a score based on its current price um, retail price rather not the sale price so probably retails around about 60 something dollars if it's on sale at the moment at 60% off I mean, probably 70 dollars isn't it really my maths not doing great today um, so is it worth around about the 60 70 whatever it is for a full retail price um, it really depends if you need it to be honest you get a lot of pops you get a lot of assets you get a lot of stuff with it and to be honest if you needed a residential high quality high quality residential home then this is the asset that you would pick up because it ticks all of the boxes all of the boxes except for the fridge and appliances not opening all of the boxes except for the house being too clean like an IKEA catalog and all of the boxes apart from you not having multiple different variations of textures with that in mind it's lovely obviously you've watched this video by now you've got to this point unless you fast forwarded and you know I really do like it I'm a fan they've converted me I love it I'm gonna give this three and a half fridges out of five that's right three and a half I know you need to fill off your chair it's the highest score I've given anything so far well three and a half fridges out of five I think it's well worth it and it's worth picking up now you're crazy if you don't get it while it's on sale can't say that enough really it is very nice you just don't get the little things you don't get the toilet seat popping out you know the, those small little finite touches that would elevate this to that extra level it's just not there yet to be exceptional it's good and it's actually better than a lot of the stuff that I've seen on the asset store but I think three and a half is quite fair well okay guys that's it for now I'm gonna go back and make some more tutorials play about with my code that I'm doing so if you do like these videos remember to click like subscribe share it phone up your friends knock on your neighbors door bang on the walls and tell them all about these videos and if that's not enough well just click it until next time and if you like this video and you want to see more click on that nice big red subscribe button that's down below and on the left side of your screen hopefully there's some videos playing so why don't you just give them a click and see what it's all about remember if you like it click it